Manufacturing is creation. It's taking an idea, putting thought to it, and creating something. What we've been able to do here is help our customers get from where they are to where they need to be. Texas Injection Molding is a, a custom injection molding company of plastic products. We make several hundred products for a dozen different industries, mostly industrial, but we cover air conditioning, HVAC, construction, traffic control, firearms, medical devices, and many other industries. We understand our customers and their products. We become part of their business. I think that they value the fact that we're gonna be truthful, we're gonna do what we say we're gonna do, and we're gonna treat them with fairness and respect, and we just don't lose customers. And beyond that, we don't lose people. The whole business is about the people and trying to arrange a team of people that collectively we can provide some pretty unique solutions that come from the diverse background that we offer. My name is Dr. Sanju Patro. I'm the director of TMAC in the Gulf Coast region of Texas. TMAC is part of the MEP National Network. Texas Injection Molding, we've been working with them for, I would say, five to six years now. TMAC's been very helpful to us as a small business. When we went to do our quality management system and needed be ISO 9001-2015 certified, they were able to help us become certified. We also worked with them closely on training. They were able to help us find grants and to work with the local community college. Texas Injection Molding is not just a typical small manufacturer. They are very much involved in the community. Jeff considers his team a family. When the COVID-19 pandemic came about, his first priority was, what do I do to make sure I don't have to lay off any individual in here? When COVID hit, we had some calls for face shields and we knew that people needed those. So we were able to pivot pretty quickly, build tooling and within three weeks, again, making 5,000 face shields a day. We contacted the Texas Manufacturing Assistance Center and they were able to help us get the word out to the people in other counties. When you're up against the wall and you got to figure out how to keep your people in Employed, you figure it out. We wouldn't be here today if it wasn't for the people that we have both working for us and the support structure that we have on the outside. Those people that are committed to manufacturing and committed to help bringing ideas to market, they're maybe not recognized like a healthcare hero or an educator, but those are the heroes of society. Somebody that's behind the scenes is building these products that other people take for granted from the PPE to COVID testing, all the materials that are used in the delivery of the vaccines. There's product that we manufacture that are used in the disposal of medical waste. All the way through the process, manufacturing is critical. In the spring of 2021, we'll be moving into a 65,000 square foot custom built facility. That'll give us the ability to provide a platform for our employees to prosper and for this whole region to be able to have a, a manufacturing plant that can continue to develop innovative products for multiple industries. We're not just here to be the biggest manufacturing company. It's about employing folks, manufacturing products in the United States, and having a darn good time while we're doing it. The greatest endeavor that we as humans can do is bring ideas to market and improve our society.